Hello vinyl community slash cassette community <laughs> as it seems to be uh, quite often these days. Um, I have a, a quick unboxing video. Uh, this is a little box of cassettes that I won on eBay. Nothing too spectacular in there but as I won, the, won them for a grand total of 99 cents plus $7 shipping, you know, <laughs> you can't go too far wrong, right? Uh, you can see that we're in the, the garage um, to record this tonight just because everybody's in bed and I don't want to wake anybody up if I record it in my usual listening spot. So that's where we're at. So I've already taken the tape off. Let's have a quick look, shall we? So what we've got in here. Alrighty, a whole bunch of them spilling out. Okay. It's mostly, mostly like 90s stuff. So here we go. Like I said, I paid like $8 something total, including shipping for this. So yeah. First up, we have the Bodyguard soundtrack. I do have this on vinyl already. Um, but uh, oh, well, that looks like it's on chrome tape. Interesting. Yeah, it is. Hmm. That's cool. Very cool. Next up we have, oh, it's a classic, Tina Turner, Private Dancer. Yeah, with uh, What's Love Got To Do With It is on here. I Can't Stand The Rain, Better Be Good To Me, Let's Stay Together, Private Dancer. Yeah, what a great album. Great album. Now this one's got a bit of an issue. The pad's going to need re -dlawing. Right there, I don't know if you can, if you look in the middle, maybe it's hard to see on camera, but the uh, the pad has come unstuck, so that's going to need a little bit of super glue, um, which I've done before, I haven't done it for years, but I've done it before, so i have to go buy some super glue. Uh, next up we have Paula Abdul, Spellbound, not an album that I'm familiar with, um, okay, but I do know the songs Rush Rush and Vibology, so yeah, Vibology is a interesting song, Paula sounds like she's having, uh, having a moment, having some fun, which <laughs> some of the some of the noises she's making in that one, but um, yeah, that one looks all right. So cool. Okay. Next up, we have Celine Dion. Let's talk about love. And uh, we're just gonna check each tape as we go through. That one looks fine. She looks a little worn, but we'll see. Uh, this one has um. Immortality on it, which was a duet with the Bee Gees, Tell Him, which was with Barbara Streisand, and of course, My Heart Will Go On is on here too. Next up, this is another Celine Dion album, One Heart. I don't know the album, I don't think. It does have the cover of I Drove All Night on here. Uh, it's from 2003. It's the only song that I think think I recognize it at large, so yeah. Whether we keep that one, I don't know. I might give it a quick listen, see if I like it. Next we have John Cicada, self-titled album. I believe this is from 92. Yeah. It has uh, Just Another Day on it, which I regard as a little bit of a 90s classic. I love that song. Angel is another song that I know, and Do You Believe in Us is another song that I know on here as well. Um, looks okay. Looks good. Okay, and I don't think I have this on any format, so that's nice to have. Next up, oh, here's a classic. Look at that, Ace of Base, the sign. Yeah, uh, that is a classic. This tape looks good. Um, this has got several big hits on it. All that she wants, don't turn around. Cover version, of course, of the Aswad song. Um, the sign, living in danger, wheel of fortune, happy nation. Yeah. Great stuff. Next, we have Cheryl Crow, Tuesday Night Music Club, which is an album I've heard of. I don't have it, but um, it does have All I Want to Do on it. Very well known song. And this looks like it's on chrome tape, too. Yeah, neat. Okay. Cool. Three more left. Um, don't I know the artist, but I don't know it. I don't know any of her stuff really. Melissa Etheridge, Yes I Am. 
this is not the reason I bought <laughs> bought this lot. Um, just because uh, I've never never been into her music. I've never really listened to her. I don't. I wouldn't. I don't think. Oh, okay. It has come to my window on it. I do know that song. Okay. All right. Well, I know one of the songs on it. There you go. Two left. We have Mariah Carey music box. Um, apparently, this is the European edition with an extra bonus track. And it's also available on mini discs, so the label tells us. And um, that one looks good. Uh, of course, it's got Hero on here. Absolute classic. Uh, Dream Lovers on here. Anytime you need a friend. Without You, that was a huge hit as well. So, yeah. Very cool. All right, one more left. Last one. Oh, yeah. Enigma. The Cross of Changes. Uh, I love Enigma. What a classic this is. Um, this is one with Return to Innocence on it, right? Yeah, Return to Innocence. That was a huge hit in 94, I think, in the UK. Um, Age of Loneliness is another song that I recognize on here. So, not bad, you know? We only had one kind of dud tape in here, which I think can probably be salvaged with some super glue. And for $8, I'm quite happy with that. <laughs> I really am. I don't know if I'm going to give them a play yet. Um, maybe I'll test one or two of them out. But, uh, yeah, there you go. Sometimes, sometimes I'll do that on eBay. I'll put in a cheeky bid. And nine times out of ten, in fact, more than nine times out of ten, you don't win it. Because... You know, it's such a low ball bid that you, you haven't got much of a chance. But every now and then, nobody else bids on it. And, and you know, you then just hope that the seller is going to be sort of honest about it. Because that, that, that has happened occasionally where um, you get the email to say that your bid's been cancelled. Like the seller's, <laughs> the seller's not happy about how much uh, the auction went for. But, um, but there we go. Yeah. This worked out great. Very happy with this stack. So, all right, everybody. Uh, thank you as always for watching. Always appreciate everybody who comments and subscribes. And until next time, bye bye.